Final round highlights from the Web.com Tours Rust Oleum Championship held at Lakewood Country Club in Westlake, Ohio. And the rains were plaguing this area all week long. Sunday was no exception, but we did end up finishing in regulation, which is always good news. We'll start it off with Brian Ritchie on the 17th. The rookie put together a strong week here and a strong finish. That last birdie improved him to 14 under par, finishing in a tie for fifth. So that improves him up to 48th on the money list, which every point counts at this point on the web.com tour season. Michael Kim on the nine stuffs it in close there. He would go on to kick that in for birdie from about three feet out. He put together four consecutive rounds in the 60s. So he was three under through the turn and then makes this long one on the 16th. to a birdie 17 as well to finish at 16 under and the tie for third to move inside the top 20 on the money list. To 19. Patton Kazire entered the week number one on the money list and he protected that position thanks in part to that downhill birdie. He would finish tie for third on the week but still holds that top spot as number one on the money list which is very important for PGA Tour status next season. Lucas Lee on the 11th an amazing Sunday 65 for Lee. He began the day at 11 under but that birdie on 11 was a part of a four birdies in a row a double, though, on 14 was costly. Dropped him back to 15 under, but he would go on to birdie 17 right there and 18 as well to finish at 17 under par in solo second, coming just one shy of our eventual winning score. A winning score came from this man, Shane Birch, on the 13th is where we'll pick him up. This is his approach shot into the green as he spins it back to within five feet here, giving himself... A nice look at birdie. He began the day just two off the lead. He was four under on the front nine, and that was his lone birdie on the back. All pars after that one. And then this on 18. Remember, there was just a one-shot margin. Had to protect it. He lags it beautifully, and he would go in to tap in for his one-shot victory to improve the fifth on the money list. It is his third Web.com Tour victory, but his first since 2005. So Shane Birch is your winner at 18 under par.